Aye, aye. aye. All right, it's another day in the life of Miss On Point. We still in fucking Jacksonville, and uh, I got the lovely Jessica in the building with me. So let's, uh, Jessica, introduce you to the world and tell them, you know, why Here the fuck they need to be listening to what the fuck you got to say. Because I am relevant. I am fire. I am the shit. I am Duval's finest. You don't know I'm bad relevant. Eh? We do this. We live this. We wake up like this. Yes, I. I'm okay, Jessica. Fire guns on the scene, for the scene, by the scene. Yes, I. And Jessica, how long have you been doing music? Because you're not just a regular. You're not. I can't even call you a rapper. I can't even call you a singer. You are a truly, tr a true definition of an artist. So how long have you been involved with music? Oh wow, I was all in the band as a youth. Played instruments, sung in the choirs. So I've been doing this since I've been little. So officially, I'll say, you know, when you're growing up, you can't really sing. So they're like, you can't sing, you can't sing. But you be singing, though. But you be singing anyway because you, you be just singing, feel though. that shit. Okay. Yes, I was that child. Okay. I couldn't sing on key for shit. So, yeah, on an official <laughs> note, when I had my first song at the church, I probably was like six, seven. Yeah. I had a little lead. I had a little lead song. It's still my song to this day. <laughs> <laughs> so you just always had a Big love and a passion Woo. for music. Always, always from 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 birth. From birth, it's in, it's really in my bloodline. It's really in my bloodline. So is that where a lot of your inspiration and motivation for music comes from? Is the the connections with music in your past, or because I know a lot of people that seem to have grown up and grown up with music so instrumental in their life tend to see that as their main motivation and inspiration. Definitely, definitely. Like my granny, my grandmother's, my grandmother from my mother's side, she's a great writer, great lyricist, and she will lecture you to lecture can't lecture no more. <laughs> so as far as being long-winded and on a lyric lyrical level, I get that from my mother's side, my grandmother. And then my father's side, my granny, Drenny is the vocalist. Like, growing up, Drenny and all of her sisters and her cousins is in my blood. Like, it trickles down. It just don't like everybody in your family have a vocal. It trickles down for a little skip of a generation. So it was like my Drenny, her first cousin, um, and um, her sister. So you they have a like long a history of storytellers, essentially. Yeah, they had like a group, and they some vocalists, female vocalists, Retchen, Duval, Trubal, and was singing all over cousins uncles they play instruments so we really had a real little band yeah wow we did. that's actually really cool Thanks. because what i don't a lot of people don't know that a lot of the true bluegrass and hip-hop roots came from those that traveled from jacksonville along the panhandle mm -hmm. and it sounds like your family is one of those troops so to speak that used mm -hmm. to travel and perform and help make folk art what it has become All today in, 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 yeah, yeah that's that's actually really dope I'll say, I'll say, give thanks, give thanks, give thanks. so that I being that. said is, is jessica uh give a birth given name or is that a stage name actually or both actually, <laughs> at this point actually jessica it was a given name uh brother ben brother ben osiris big up yourself god him just give me that name, like, because it's I. It's like the complete I, Ja. I was seeking, and boom, I'm, I done found it. Cause it's, it's complete. Okay, so that, that makes be, a lot of sense. Yeah, and then the studies that I was on at the time, as far as going through all the studies, comedic, Hebrew, Israelite, and all just picking, picking sense from nonsense from everything. All of the studies. Picking the eye of the truth uh, from each of them. Sheo. So, yay, yay. Yay, the tribes of life still. So, that's how I got my name. That's fantastic. And it's become basically your name in everyday life, too, because that's that's how you've always been introduced to me. And I've met you on a couple of different occasions. It's never, You're always introduced by that name. So, it's uh, become, you are your lifestyle. You aren't, it's not just a persona. Like, this is how you live your life. Ashe, uh, Ashe. Uh, as well, as well, I would say, as Amoke. Amoke also came in the African village in Beaufort, in, well, not in Beaufort, South Carolina, but in South Carolina and Sheldon. 
at the African village called Oyetanji. So I was actually given that name by by a priestess. So yeah, and it means it means to be pampered. So Amoke came came upon upon a great a great time in in I like I in I life too as well. So yay. I'm okay, Jasika would be a good just on the blessed essence. by the ancestors all around. Oh, I know that's an amazing feeling. So what is the current single that you're working on or the project? Is it a project or a single? Because I know you've got a lot in the vault that I've been hearing about lately, but I don't know which one's your actual current. Okay, 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 okay. Current, current. Oh, wow. It's so many. Like, it's so many, but so many. Because I've been working on a few projects, but that, my newest project that I'm now working on is a project because I won't say it's just like a single because we actually working on video footage for, for the works as well, too. So I got a little treats coming out on the, on the essence of a love level. And then I have some extraterrestrial, got that pressure mix, like boom, 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 got some techno. It's all type of versatility coming from Empress of Moke Jossie because it's not just culture on a reggae level. You know what I'm talking about? It's culture from all perspectives on all genres coming from Aya, Aya Lips. So that's what I'm presenting and bringing to the world. Project, project, mm, what the name of it is? Shoot. That's still undecided, well, I did say huh? Pressure. I did say pressure, but pressure is actually presented already. But then as far as the videos is concerned that's coming up, what we got? We got um, our newest project. We got the Black Mind coming. Also been working on the next new project, Why Lonely B. Yo, when my soul left my RE. Yo, so just stay tuned. It's mad, mad more in store. So you done know. So tell me something that the general fan might not know about you. Wow, that's kind of deep, but it's deep and it's good because it's coming out in the book because, you know, the biography got to come forward. So, yo, it, don't nobody know that uh, Jossie, because she had a molestation time in her life, which is why in certain conversations that come up and get touchy when you start talking about the little people and, and aspects of hurting them in certain, yay, I get a little touchy-touchy because, yo, strange I things happen to a lot of the little princesses and goddesses, so don't know nobody, too many people know of, of, of the critical things that then happened in my little childhood experiences, but it made I and I the goddess that I am today. Facts. Major. Especially when you're able to overcome it and use it as part of the story and the motivation that helps you create the power and the presence of one's whole self after having to deal with it. And from speaking from, at least from my experience, and for me, it was having to do it after I suppressed it and then remembered it again mm. later in my life. Mm. So I didn't even start to process it until I was in, in my mid-20s. Ah, uh, shay, ah, uh, shay. It's like I shut down. I yeah. totally shut down, like... I could be somebody else because I want you to see this perspective and you're never going to know I. Never, ever. Yay. It took, And it took me a long time to kind of get past right there. that. That's and, strong right there. But use that as something to build off of because it is my past and I'm not going to run from it or hide from it. But Because but that's what made who I was, build, who you see. You build from it. Yay. Yes. You build yes. from it. You be the best, best aspect of yourself you can be through those trials and tribulations still. Yes. Yes, I. So, for those that want to follow you on social media and get to know you more, how can they do that? Yo, y'all subscribe, share, like, subscribe. YouTube, Empress Jasika, y'all pull it, subscribe. Y'all can find me on Amoke, A-M-O-K-E, Jasika, J-A-H, S-E-A-K-A-H, Instagram, Facebook, Yo, share, like, subscribe, follow, you done know, everywhere me go. I'm soon going to be on Spotify in a few minutes, so y'all keep looking. Google Jasika, Google Jasika, she there. Mwah. But like Miss On Point saying, don't send her no fucking dick pic, bro, because that ain't where the fuck it's at. We about that business over here, and we right. stay about that business. This your girl, Miss On Point. It's a day in the life of Miss On Point. And uh, I'm going to go sit here and enjoy this blunt with Jessica and see what the rest of the night brings. So, later, y'all. Bless up.